Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As usually, I'm gonna show you the Forza Ton and also the cars I took for the championships. So let's have a look at the photo challenge. What do we need here? We need to make a picture and that will be here. I'll put everything on. There you go. So here you have the barn find. It's basically here it's standing. But if you don't have that, you can travel here. I'll go there. There you go. There is the thing that you need on the picture. Now, there is a road. Either you go into a convoy with a friend or you wait for a Dravatar. I was lucky there was another player uh, also standing here. So just make a picture. Like this. It doesn't really matter. As long as there is your car, a Dravatar, a friend and the thing on it. So let's that's it. Okay, let's have a look at the Forzaton. As you can see, I'm in the Abart 124 Spider. We just need an Abart, uh, but I took that one because it's actually very good for the street scene. We need to reach 125 miles an hour, 200 kilometers an hour. Um, it's very simple with this car. Then you have nine stars in total of the danger sign. Now, which one did I take? I just took this one here. So you can see at the Colossus there, this one. You just go four or five times. Just um, do the danger sign and you will easily have it. Then the next one, we need to win two street scene races. Also, that's, I've been taking this one for like months, months, months. Because it's by far the easiest one. The Coastal Charge. Just put the Dravatar difficulty on new racer and you can do it twice and you can easily win with the card. So don't worry, it's fast enough, grippy enough, you won't have any problems with it. Then, the trial. For some reason, it's the second week. When I do the trial, I get kicked out in the first race or the second race. So I have no idea what's going on. But let's have a look what cars that we need. We need modern supercar and S1. So let's have a look at the S1 modern supercars. We have a lot of choices, as you can see. Well, this is actually in my garage. Uh, my favorite one is the Ascari. Um, it's a very fast, good, grippy handling car. I would definitely recommend this car. You can also take the McLaren, that was one of my favorite cars. Uh, problem is, they did something about the handling of the car, but yet you still can win from the Dravatars. Or you can also use the McLaren 650S. I don't have a tune for it, I was building a tune, but I took the Ascari because it's actually the easiest car to win. Now, what can we win from that? Uh, let's have a look. We win actually the McLaren 720S Spider. Then the Showcase Remix. It's in the Aerial Nomad uh, with, the, with the bikes. I actually had to do it four times because three times the bikes ramped me out for some reason. But what can we win from the Showcase? I can't remember to be honest. It's probably a wheel spin. Now let's go to summer games. What do we need for the summer games? Oh, where are you summer games? There we go. So we need a B class 700 of the 80s. Let's have a look at the 80s. The year and then we take DCB. And then we go to the 80s. Now, you got a lot of choices here. Uh, just remember, it's on the beach. Uh, for example, this one, you can put a big-ass engine in it. Uh, this one is actually also very good. This one is also good. The little turbo is also good. Basically, it's what you prefer in, uh, in this one. I can't say... I just know that this one has a really OP engine that you can do. Um, but also like this car, the Renault Turbo is pretty fast and pretty stable also. 
So it depends a little bit. Uh, tonight I'm streaming on Twitch and I'll have a look again what I'm gonna take for the playgrounds. But if you have this one, you can use that one. The Rover also has an OP engine in it. Um, so it's a little bit what you, what you prefer. Now, what can we win from playgrounds? We win the Toyota MR2 of 1989. Then let's have a look. Oh, I forgot the Forzaton shop. What do we have in the Forzaton shop? That's a very good car. Koenigsegg, the CCX, very nice car. Um, this one was a rare car, but doesn't really matter. I don't really use that car. And then we have a nice modern race suit and a horn. Then let's go to the championships. We need a Nissan B700. Now, you know, I always watch in the auto show that you actually can buy the car. Now, I'll go show you how I choose my car. Now, I tried to tune this one. It doesn't steer very well. Also, for this one, it didn't steer very well. Now, this is also a very good car. Everybody knows that. But I actually took the... 97 nissan skyline why it's i'm gonna be honest it's not the fastest car but for the championship you can basically go almost full throttle in every corner it's extremely grippy and cornering so i really recommend you to try this car out um i tried other cars but it just didn't work out um and i really like to have a car that has good grip and you can easily win now, what can we win from that? That's the Nissan Cup. That's the hashtag 64 Nissan 370C. But I will show that on the end of the video. It's a Formula Drift car. Now, let's have a look at the Rally Monsters. What do we need? A800 Rally Monster. So, we're going to... I always do it like this and then let's go to the rally monsters oh here it is so this is what i have in my garage uh, you also can't buy much now i just took the opal manta it's a very cheap car and it's a very good car for this trust me you will win easily with this car you can also take this one but i really do not like the the gearing of of that car um Subaru, Mitsubishi, they all have the same uh, delayed gearing. But this one is really nice to drive with. You can also take this one if you have that. Uh, it was an extreme wear car, but this one slides a little bit more. You can put a good engine in it, but I do prefer if you want to have it safe and a good car, take the Opel Manta. Now, what can we win for that? We win a Ford Fiesta RS. Then, a uh, snug as a buggy. We need A800 off-road buggies. That is actually very simple. Let's go. There's only actually one car that is like really, really good. Where are you? There you go. So as you can see, I have several buggies that I can use. Um, this one is still in B class, but I didn't want to take that um, because I'll just keep it in the B class. Now, if you have this car, you can buy it in the other show. Just take this car. With this car, you can easily win. Um, this is also not a bad car. I remember using it in the championship. Um, as you can see, it's also tuned. You can also use that if you want. Uh, but the Nomad is just easier and uh, handles a lot better and sharper. You can also try this car. Um, but my main choice is the Nomad. And then you can take also the Alumicraft. If you have it. It's a Forza Edition. Now, what can we win from that? We win the Regal Wave Emote. I didn't check out it yet what it is um, here you need to do the monthly rivals just do a clean lap and you have it and online adventure is locked for some reason 
I have no clue why this is locked. This is the first time I play this game in more than two years that it's locked. Ah, I need to receive my rewards first. Okay, let's go to the stunts. Here you have the danger sign. And I fast travel to here. And of course I took my motor again. Um, it's just a car that always works on, on the stunts. Where are you? There you are. I'll take my road tuned muzzler. You actually don't need to go far for this one. I just put it in second gear, third gear, uh, and then there you go. If you press the normal brake, you can, um, with a arrow, you can actually make the car fall on its nose and then it will uh, slide further. But you don't need it uh, on this danger sign. Then here is the same. You go either you go up or you go down. I did both, and you can do both. It doesn't really matter. The car is fast enough. I did it in second gear. I just put the car in second gear. There you go. You need to be careful. You don't have to go too fast in the corners, you just pull up, brake on time. As you can see, there you go, that's enough for this one. Then the next one, where was it? It's all spread out here, the speed trap, you can actually just well, you can start from here to be safe. Just need to watch the traffic cars. Of course, you can take other cars like the Ferrari or whatever you prefer. Just make sure it's a uh, false acceleration. Ah, car. There you go. So the stunts are actually pretty easy uh, this time. Well, that's basically it for this season. Um, the trial, yeah, for some reason I got kicked out. And playgrounds, I will... The trial on the playgrounds and the whole festival playlist I will do tonight at my Twitch. So I hope everybody comes and join me so we can get the cars together. Now I'll show you the complete new car. It's a Formula Drift. There you go. Here it is. I definitely gonna tune that and maybe make a video about it when i do drifting on the needle it's real wheel drive well i think it's gonna be basically the same like the ferrari or the viper okay let's have a look at the car Well, I'm actually very curious uh, after it's tuned and see what we can do on the needle and other um, drift zones. There you go. So this is the complete new car that we get for this week. And let's have a look here at 50% uh, Rymac. I never used that car i'm not really a fan of one gear and the apollo the apollo is a very good car um so definitely try to get 80 percent well that's it i hope you enjoyed my video and that the car choices will help you get the cars that you want for the championships and also feel free to come tonight at my twitch at 9 30 cst well 9 30 pm thanks for watching See you later. Bye-bye.